Day one of the Democratic National Convention kicked off in Chicago tonight with a night full of speeches and a passing of the torch in the party. Security is tight for the event, which has also brought protesters to the city. CBS News correspondent Skyler Henry reports tonight. Vice President Kamala Harris briefly took the stage on night one of the DNC to greet almost 5,000 delegates and tens of thousands of party faithful as the Democratic presidential nominee. This is going to be a great week. And I want to kick us off by celebrating our incredible president, Joe Biden. The day one themed for the people also belonged to President Biden, who delivered the keynote address after stepping aside in his bid for a second term. Are you ready to vote for freedom? Yeah. Are you ready to vote for democracy and for America? Yeah. Former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton gave an emotional address, employing Democrats to keep fighting. The future is here. It's in our First Lady Jill Biden also spoke. Kamala and Tim, you will win. This is the 12th time Chicago has hosted the convention, including 1968, when the DNC brought violent protests, which overshadowed much of what was happening on the stage. How many kids do you kill today? To prevent a repeat, police are keeping demonstrators several blocks away from the venue and made a handful of arrests after some protesters pushed through a first level offensive. The whole world's watching. Hello? Democrats. The four-day event will also feature speeches from former presidents Barack Obama and Bill Clinton. Good night, everyone. Harris will be back Thursday to formally accept the party's nomination for president. Skyler Henry, CBS News, Chicago.